Rob, disappointing result today, but from the players' point of view, were there some positives to take, particularly from the first first half performance? Yeah, I think that was more like us uh, this week compared to last last weekend. Um, you know, we um, <coughs> certainly created a few opportunities and got into their half, put balls into the box, and um, you know, it was just unfortunate that we couldn't get on the end of it, put a ball away, and. Uh, get ourselves into the lead. Must have felt really against the run of play and a bit of a, not quite a sucker punch, but very much against the run of play when Bradford scored. It must have been a real real downer f- for the players. Yeah, I mean, they play some good football and they had a lot of the ball. Um, but yeah, they hadn't really threatened our goal too much. And um, yeah, it was a bit of a sloppy goal to concede from ourselves. And uh, yeah, it was a bit of a sucker punch at was that time. It was, what was it, right sort of five but, minutes before yeah. half time. So uh, yeah, no, it was a difficult one to take, but... Um, these things up. Saw, saw a few hopeful looks at the assistant. Were you hoping the flag might go up? Yeah, I mean, I think there's the Brat Four are probably looking at the assistant. Uh, sorry, the uh, linesman. But um, no, it wasn't to be. And the second goal going in early at the start of the second half made it made it a difficult game to get difficult game to get back into. Yeah, I mean, at one 0 you're always in the game, so you know that we can uh, we can always get ourselves back in the game. When it gets to two 0 obviously it becomes a bit more difficult, but. Um, you know, it was a great strike by the lad. He's put it straight in the top corner. So, um, yeah. And, and you know, two 0 down, still over over half an hour to go. The feeling must have been that we could still, on the way we played that that far, we could still get back into the game. Yeah, you know, we always try and fight to the end. And you know, if we can try and put balls into the box, that something might break for us, and we might get a goal. So, you know, all the boys are sticking at it, and that's all we can do. And hopefully, things will change uh, sooner rather than later. And. You know, the more the game went on, was it was it getting more difficult to break down the Bradford defence? They are one of the promotion favourites, and um, the way they manage the game. Yeah, it's difficult. They're uh, you know a good team, a good manager, good players, and they are difficult to break down. But um, you know we we kept pushing for the for the goal, and it wasn't to be on this occasion. But we dust ourselves down and go again Saturday. And the injury problems well documented at the moment, but the yeah. player spirit looked looked didn't look anything wrong with the spirit from the from looking at the uh, looking at the performance this afternoon still no we were a good group in there you know we were trying our best to stick together and the more we do that you know the results will come and hopefully you know next next week home to home to Rochdale yeah. um, get in front of the home supporters again and hopefully get a, a different result this time and, and turn turn the performances around turn the results around yeah it's a big game just like any any game at the moment's a big game you know we need to uh, get back to winning ways uh, we need to start putting bo- points on the board again so uh, now I'm <coughs> we'll be look training hard this week you know working on the strengths and weaknesses to <coughs> combat Rochdale yeah. so um no, I'm looking forward to the game next Saturday. And is a, a, a sort of characteristic of this team they do keep keep going and shrug off shrug off the setbacks. So as you say, next next week will be a good good opportunity to do so. Yeah, exactly that. You know, uh, fortunate in football that there's always another game around the corner. So um, it'd be good to get it back here, especially at home, and try and build on you know some of the positives from today and get that get that win next weekend. Brilliant. Well, thanks for coming out to talk to us, Rob, and uh, see you next week. Thank you. Cool.